Alright guys, today's video I'm going to show you guys on my Droid Razor HD. Uh, this has the unlocked boot bootloader, obviously has root access and has torp recovery already installed. If you don't know how to do any of those things on your Droid Razor HD then, or the Droid Razor HD Max, um, watch my videos. I have videos on all three of those things and how to get it to this state where I'm at right here. Um, so what I'm going to show you today is how to make an Android backup and then how to restore an Android backup um, and just show you how that function all works. So um, just to go over some prerequisites with you on this thing, let me just show you what I'm running just so we're all on the same page here. We're going to scroll down to about phone and you can see this is Android version 4.1.2 Droid Razor HD and it is the XT926 phone version so we got that out of the way um, and then what you can do is you just I use this app I really love this app it's called Razor Toolbox um, and it actually allows you to let me see when it boots up here allows you to go to a reboot menu like where's that reboot menu and then you can just tell it what to do reboot right into recovery or you can install this widget right here and reboot right into recovery by just clicking that button but if you don't have the application you don't want to install it, let me show you the other way to get into recovery. We're just going to power off the normal way. This is the stock ROM right here. So we're just going to power off. Shouldn't take too long here, just a second. And then what we're going to do is we're going to, going to get into bootloader mode and then select recovery from bootloader mode. This is how you're going to need to get into bootloader mode and recovery if you ever have a problem um, and you brick your device for some reason your torp recovery is permanently in there so this would be how to get into it so you're going to hold both your volume up and down and then push your power and hold it until you see this screen you're going to scroll down once with the volume down and then volume up to select when you hit recovery and this will boot into your recovery system now if you have stock recovery installed still it's just going to boot to stock recovery if you have torp recovery or clockwork mod recovery it's going to boot to those so let me just show you um, what I have here already. I've already made an Android backup before um, when I first got my bootloader unlocked and Torp installed. So if I go to restore, this is the name of the backup I made already. Um, so I'm going to restore that, but first I'm going to make a backup of what I have right now. So to make an Android backup, um, you're just going to go to here, go to backups. You're going to select everything you want to back up, and I want to back up all of it. And then um, set backup name right there. So I'm going to click that, and I'm going to type in today's date, which is 4 18 And then I'm going to say stock because this is a stock, it's not a ROM. And hit go. So that's the name of my backup right up there on top. Um, everything looks good. Enable compression takes longer but saves some space on your phone. I'm not going to mess with it right now. So we're just going to go ahead and swipe across and it's going to create our first Android backup. So this is the backup process. Backup process is going to take anywhere from 5 to 10 minutes um, depending on what you have on your phone. So I'm just going to go ahead and let this thing run and we'll come back to it when it wraps up. Alright, so now that our backup has finished. We're just going to go ahead and go into restores and you can see where your backup is right here. That's the backup I just created and this is an old backup I have. So if you want to um, restore this, it's very simple. All you need to do is just click on it and then it's going to restore all this stuff and it's actually going to wipe it all first so that it restores it correctly. Um, really simple to do. So all you have to do right here is swipe across. Now I'm going to rename this backup because I don't like the name it's, it's got right now. So I'm going to go ahead and set rename backup. And we're going to rename this to first back up. Because it's the first backup I made. And we're going to go ahead and swipe that and just go ahead and rename it and go back. So there, there we go, now it's called First Backup. So I'm going to go ahead and restore that and just show you how this restores. Um, like I said, it's going to wipe all this, these slots first so you don't have any of your old data on there. And then it's going to install everything that I created on that backup when I created it. 
and then I'm gonna reboot the phone and show you guys what that looks like. So we're gonna let this run. You can see right here, formatting system, user, blah, 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 done. It's formatting things as it restores. So we're just gonna let this run again. Probably gonna take, you know, up to five minutes probably to do this. Um, so just be patient on it, five, 10 minutes maybe. Um, also, obviously, before you do any kind of backup or restoring, make sure you have good battery life. I've got 69%, 70% there. So not gonna hurt anything on this device. If you're below 60%, I wouldn't even do an and, a restore or anything. In case this thing dies on you don't want it dying in the middle of that process. So let's let this run and we'll get back to it. Alright, so our system now here on the Droid Razor HD has been restored. So I'm gonna unlock the screensaver there. And we should just be able to reboot system and show you guys how this thing has now gone back to what it was originally. Um, I think one of the things also not I did make a backup after I changed that boot logo, so that's interesting. Um, I thought it might have, still have the uh, unlock bootloader logo there. So if that's gone, oh, so this is still here. I also have changed this in my um, phone when, it, when I showed it to you earlier. So this was just a Motorola logo pulsating at you for the boot animation. So this has been restored. Let's let this thing boot up. I'm just going to show you the ROM, show you the difference. And uh, that will kind of wrap it up. That is how to make an Android backup, how to restore an Android backup. So those are the two main things you're really going to want to know on this device. Uh, and once you know that, you can make backups of ROMs and restore the ROM, all that goodies. So you can see here my wallpaper is different. Um, let's just show you what else I can show you that's a little different. I still have that in there, which is my reboot menu. My setup's pretty close to the same because I do really like this setup. Don't I only have two pages, not three right there. And let's see what else we got. So, yeah, pretty pretty basic. But there you go. That is the name that I made, and that's how to restore it. I said, hope you guys like this video. Hope this gives you great information to continue on with your hacking on the Droid Razor HD. Uh, if you like this, please give me a thumbs up. Um, follow me right here on rootjunkie.com. Lots of great stuff on there. Update that thing daily. Um, follow me on Facebook or Twitter, and we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.